everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Woki, and I'm here with Sparking Zero, because today is Sparking Zero Day, if you have early access, and actually this is the day afterwards, because these, these videos uploads the day afterwards. So it's currently the 8th. Uh, Sparking Zero's out! Yeah! And I'm gonna play it, finally, yeah! I did not, I saved you the trouble of me doing, going through the Great Ape fight. Um, I did that, and then I immediately said, I don't remember how to fight apes in the old games, <laughs> and then I remembered just sidestep them, don't fight them like a normal person, so I'm here with, uh, uh, post that, I've done some training, I'm ready to lose, I'm ready to go back in here, I've heard some stuff about the actual story stuff being pretty difficult, you don't know what this is, this is Sparking Zero, uh, here's Goku, it's him, Goku, I'm gonna continue the story of Goku. Okay, let's do this thing! Perfect. Let's go, Goku. Uh, I used to. I don't know how much of this game I'll play on here, but as long as I'm playing it, I'm gonna keep going here. I think this is a special case only because a lot of the old stuff I used to do was Dokkan related, so I figured there are at least a decent amount of people who would want to see me play through this. So I'm gonna play forever right now. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll vibe and see what's going on. About one month. If you do want to end up seeing more of it, you have to leave a like and comment. But also at the same time, if I don't feel like that, if I don't feel it, then I'm not going to upload it. But anyway, I'm on Namek right now. Uh, Goku's going to take some Sensu beans. He's going to go to Planet Namek. You remember the Namek saga. He shows up. Just ignore everything that happened with between uh, Krillin and Gohan during this. I assume if you go to Gohan's story, maybe they talk about it a little bit more. But this is all about Goku. Here's Vegeta. He's beating up on Zarbon over here in his monstrous form. Skipping the part where Zarbon completely destroyed him the first time. That's how you know they're like, nah, let's hurry up. And then Vegeta gets destroyed by the Ginyu Force. Here's Raikoum. And his post getting slightly um, damaged by everyone else form. Farty. Bomber! My god, your neck, Reku! <laughs> what is going on with my boy's neck? Uh. Oh, is this a lore Sorry. accurate fight? You were wide open, so I just went for it. This is lore accurate Reku fight. You little punk. Uh. Nice of them to keep Look, in the cheeks. Got a choice to make here. Either get off this planet and go home. Or you're gonna wind up like your friend here. Did you hear that, Bertha? Uh -huh. This jolt knocks out Raccoon with a lucky shot, and suddenly he's dishing out threats to the likes of us. Mm, he's got some nerve. You know, I Let's would be kind of worried if I saw my dude get completely destroyed in one hit. Let's go! Yeah! That's just me, though. All right. All right. Perfect. 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 Oh, perfect. I need to remember to dodge. Oh god. He is completely opening me up on every single case. Okay, there we go. Get back here. All right, let me just charge up. Sure, give me your energy. Let me see if I can reach him from here. Oh! Nope. <laughs> oh. Nope. Go! Get over here. Yep. There we go. Okay. I did the wrong move again. <laughs> it's fine. Oh, I should have. I tried to dodge out of that, but that was not the way to go. Alright, this time for real. 20 times coming on me, huh? Nope, actually, I'm gonna go into the bigger mode. This is exactly how he should have just taken out Jace frame one from Namek. I feel like this is an appropriate response to give to Jace immediately. Just throw the spirit bomb. <laughs> he 
Yeah, that's exactly how it with Goku. Why didn't Goku just do that from the start? Why did he save till Frieza? He just should have fucking thrown this mirror bomb at Jace immediately. I did not beat him that way. He was kicking my ass up until I threw that spirit bomb. Goku swiftly overpowers two members of the Ginyu Force. After another manages to escape, but Goku has more than demonstrated the fruits of his training. He hears about the Dragon Balls from Gohan and the others, but, uh, but before they can take action, Goku senses a strong key heading in the direction of Guru. Goku tells the others to head straight for the Dragon Balls while he readies himself once more. It's time for him to put an end to Captain Ginyu. Why is Birder here? Did I change the timeline because I killed oh, Jace instead of guy, Birder? Huh? His power level's only around 5,000. Holy shit. That's I him, Captain. Don't be fooled. This freak's way stronger than that. He must be capable of boosting his strength in the midst of combat. From what I can tell, I'd say his true power level is somewhere around 60,000. 60,000? But that can't be. This guy's just a puny Saiyan. It's not unheard of. He could have a natural talent, or perhaps his abilities have been amplified by a mutation like us. Either by way, this battle's sure to be interesting. To think I'd find an opponent that I can finally demonstrate my full power on. So, are we gonna dance or fight? I mean, if it's Ginyu, there's a chance of him just dancing. Does that mean if I can kill Ginyu before he can swap my body, can I change the outcome of the fight? This is gonna be good! I mean, he definitely just tried that. I could feel it. Get him! Damn it, he blocked. There we go. Uh, him with the times 20 coming, coming, huh? There we go. Damn it. Without Vegeta, this isn't exactly gonna be a cakewalk. I feel like if I could just do the spear bomb, I'd be able to kill him pretty quickly. But in again, and it'll be you I pulverize. Understood? There we go. Oh. I'm doing I keep doing the accidental block thing. That's not what I want to do. Oh, come on. There we go. Nope. I should be able to hit from here, right? Nope. Yeah. <laughs> Your strength is unbelievable. Yeah, I think I'll take it. What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? I wonder if I would have hit him with the spirit bomb and instantly killed him. Could I have skipped the entirety of the body change thing? Ah, giant beam. I mean, it's not his beam. It's like his, his soul. Suddenly, Captain Ginyu begins chuckling. Then he lets out a deafening scream. In doing so, he triggers a technique that enables him to switch bodies with Goku. Now in control of Goku's body, Captain Ginyu heads back to his spaceship with his subordinate. Goku makes a desperate chase after them, but he is hindered, trapped in Captain Ginyu's uh, injured body. Guys, listen! That's not me, it's Ginyu! Using my body! The others arrive to find Goku battling his own body. Unknowns to everyone, Vegeta has his own plans for Ginyu, but first... Ah, burner! Seeing that Birder has lost his will to fight, Vegeta ruthlessly put an end to his life. Vegeta, why? They couldn't even defend themselves! Shut up! You're too soft-hearted, Kakarot! It's kill or be killed! Why do you- don't- don't be doing this to Birder, man. After finishing off Birder, Vegeta shifts his attention to Ginyu, who has taken over Goku's body. Now it's time to finish the job! Now die! I bet they just skip all of this, basically. I guess not. Change now! Please let this work. I mean, I have no reason, idea why it wouldn't. Goku rushes in, intercept good news body change technique, and is able to reclaim his own body just in the nick of time. Bastard! How dare you! You ruined everything! 
back to being me again. What, what the hell is going on? What does Kakarot think he's doing? I better swap with a fresh body and quick. Damn, I mean, he goes. I mean, it says something about Vegeta that he this technique almost worked on him again. It wasn't until Goku threw a frog. Suspecting Ginyu's plan, Goku throws a frog between the captain and Vegeta. What in the world? Whew, that was a close one. Poor frog in Ginyu's body. He didn't want to live like this. Thwarted, Captain Ginyu is now trapped inside a frog and Goku is saved. Goku is then put inside the medical machine to recover. However, he can sense Super Vegeta and the others fighting nearby. Now get ready. We're just going to skip all the phases up until final form. Feel free to play the other story if you want to see the actual full Frieza fight. Meanwhile, Vegeta and the others sense an immense power coming from their opponent, one that far exceeds their own. Just as he is marveling at Frieza's strength, Goku's treatment finishes and he fully he is fully healed. Try to hang on just a little bit longer. I'm on my way, guys. When Goku arrived at the raging battle, Vegeta is moments away from death at Frieza's hands. I I'm begging you, please beat him for me, for the pride of our race. You must defeat him. Please, he must die by a Saiyan's hand. Do it. And so the battle between Goku and Frieza begins. For you to beg me for my help. I can only imagine how hard that must have been for you to do. I may have hated you when you were alive, but I always respected your pride. And now, it's time for me to share that pride. Pride in myself. Prideful Goku. I am a Saiyan that was raised on planet Earth. And in the name of every single Saiyan that you've made suffer, for them, and all the people of planet Namek too, I will defeat you! And I would just love to see you try. He says, fucking try it. Both of you, we need to get out of here and quick. <laughs> it's a hilarious mid-flight of Piccolo up there. Go on. You got it, Gohan. I'm gonna kill. Daddy's gonna kill Frieza. Oh shit! All right. I don't know if I've ever felt this excited oh, about the prospect of a battle in my entire life. Now I only need to decide how to kill you. Oh fuck! I think I'll toy with you a bit. Come on, I had to have teleported. No. Oh? Why don't we finish with the rehearsal and commence with the real battle? Okay. I'm just gonna be underwater for a bit. Hope that's cool. That is not cool, apparently. Share your energy with me. You Oh god, what did he just hit me with? Alright, I got him. <laughs> really appreciate all the underwater ambiance going on right here. Okay, uh oh. Okay. I'm gonna have to hit this guy with my strongest technique, which is the spirit bomb. Come on, this has to have hit. Oh, come on. There we go. Unfortunately, he is really high fucking health, and I am not. Is, uh, you okay here, bro? <laughs> uh, Frieza? Frieza, you okay, buddy? Oh, no, damn it! Really hoping I wouldn't have to rely on 
this again, if I want to win this fight, my only choice is to gather enough energy for a spirit bomb. Please. You see, I'm able to survive in the vacuum of space. But can you? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Hit him, hit him with. Come on, that has to hit. Come on. <laughs> it sounds really weird when you're doing it underwater like this. Makes it seem a lot more like an ASMR fight than anything else. Sure, I'll take that. <laughs> that was maybe a little bit weird. I feel like that is not the way you're supposed to beat it, with mostly fighting underwater. Goku Spirit Bond has finally brought an end to the long and hard fought battle. At last, our heroes can rest, or so they think. Until. No, it, it can't be. Freeze us alive! Yeah, it's not it's gonna take more than a single Spirit Bomb to take uh, this dude out. Not Piccolo again. He literally just came back to life. I advise against placing too much stock in your escape. Shoutouts to D3. Like, this is gore of his home. comfort character. <laughs> yeah, those are also the final words I'd say if I was about to no, destroy. Frieza, don't do it. Luffy. Still not, they can never really show how badly <laughs> fucked up it is that how we killed the Krillin in these, the in these games. Next. Except for actually Kakarot. I think Kakarot actually shows it pretty well. Moss, see you turn into a Super Saiyan. Find Bulma, find the spaceship, and go! But... But... Do as I tell you right now, before I lose what little sense of reason I have left! He says this, but then he ends up with letting Frieza go at the end, so I feel like he never actually lost all his senses. Overcome with pure rage at seeing Krillin die before his very eyes, Goku transforms into a legendary Super Saiyan. Once again, the triumph, the trumpets of battle sound. Frieza, whose body can survive even in the vacuum of space, has decided to launch an attack powerful enough to destroy Planet Namek in its entirety. With five minutes left until Planet Namek's extinction, Frieza finally reaches full power. His power is expanding even more than his muscles. This really must be 100% of his full power. Yep, it this is he it will never go more full power than this. It also may be the only chance I'll ever have to fight him. If he really is the strongest being in the whole universe, I need to see if I can beat him myself. There's no point to this! Stop Krillin trying. Be brought back to life with the Dragon Balls a second time, and I refuse to take the death of my best friend sitting down. Krillin was my best friend. Frieza took him from me. He killed him in an instant, like he was nothing. Eighty-five percent now. Ninety. Frieza, just know the only reason I'm letting you reach full power is because I want to beat you at your best. No regrets for either one of us. I know you want the same thing. You're itching to see what your 100% full power is capable of. Otherwise, you would have blown up the whole planet by now. Hmm. <laughs> Funny man, Goku. Thank you. My apologies for the way. As requested, this is my full power. Then do you want to finish this, or are you just going to keep talking? Whoa. Oh shit, he dodged it. I didn't know that you could do that. <laughs> Alright. Thanks for just staying far the hell away for some reason. And letting me go. <laughs> uh, where the hell is 
Where the hell is he? There he is. Come on, this should be enough. This should get him. I cannot believe I missed again. Ow. It's okay. We're both back down to our weaker form. Oh yeah, if you want to power up, I'll do the same. Oh shit. Probably shouldn't have done that. That's alright. How did you miss so many of those shots, Goku? His name was Krillin. Are you talking about Krillin? Don't you dare say his name! Oh shit, is that Beam Flash? Wait! Don't make that wish! Ask the dragon to leave both Frieza and me behind! Come on, kick him in the face! Oh, I missed that completely! Serious, King Kai. You have to let me finish this battle with Frieza, or I'll never forgive you. No, right, fine. You win. But you really better be. Don't make me regret this. Yeah, I've got you. Come on. I'm not done. Come on. Okay, here we go. Do it once again. Thank you very much for waiting. <laughs> Yes! Kick him in the face. Oh, please don't die from this. I guess you, you will die from this, never mind. <laughs> I was trying to end it with the Kamehameha so bad. Alright. Just like in the manga and anime, where Frieza gets kicked in the face and that's it for him. <laughs> oh, the irony. He who triumphs loses everything, while the vanquished escapes. I hate to gloat, but there's a lesson here on the virtue of mercy. This is how I start so talking whenever I lose to Zen in a fighting vote. game. We'll see about that. Later. I am Lord Frieza, the most powerful being in the universe. Which is why... Which is why you must die by my hand. You fool! All right, they did. You fool! I was kind of hoping it would be a return of fighters, and he says, "You idiot." I forget if it was Kakarot or, or this one. If it was you idiot that they said, it is very funny though. After a desperate struggle, Goku defeats Frieza. He tries to escape from the crumbling remains of Planet Namek. But the battleship he found is too damaged to be piloted. Luckily, he spies a pod piloted by the Ginyu Force, and with that, safely, but narrowly escapes Planet Namek. Uh, ignore it during the anime with the part where he just screams and the Planet Namek while it explodes. Yet the pod is not headed for Earth, it's destined for Planet Yadrot, and Goku learns a new technique. Goku's battle photo collection. Thank you, and I got some Zenny from that. Uh, that was all the Namek. I assume that if you go, what is this? Oh, I have to defeat him with the spirit bomb. I did do that. Oh, so it's like a different condition. I actually, I'm kind of curious. Go back here. Namek arc. Goku Saga, Goku Saga, this is Vegeta. Defeat Jace. So this is the slight branch that I had here where it was Birder and Ginyu. Okay, I see what they're saying. So then this one right here 
because I beat him with a spirit bomb, it was different. All right. Cool. That's Sparking Zero for now. Uh, this is a pretty cool game. I think it's pretty fun. Um, there looks like there's enough, as you can see here. Like, I have Goku Black. I got Frieza. I got Piccolo. I got Gohan. There's plenty of stuff here if you're someone who's, like, not that interested in playing in the online. Especially because, as it is early days going, you're going to be finding a lot of people who probably do know what the hell they're doing. So... <laughs> Probably better. There's plenty of things here that you can do where it's like, oh yeah, I'm just gonna play around, do some stuff, get some challenges, go visit up uh, Lord Zeno over here where he can tell me this was cool or thank you. Thank you, Weiss. Thank you. Let me go back. Can I go back? Can I go back? There we go. I always forget that he had to hold back, not just press back. Here he is. Zeno saying one saying one of his two lines right here. Thanks a lot. I'm so happy. Thanks so happy. Thanks a lot. Aw. I'm thanks a lot. No, he's just so happy. Thanks a lot? Thank you. Thanks a lot. Damn. <laughs> I failed the gotcha roll multiple times on that one. He's just too happy right now. Ain't nothing I can do to bro. I'll take that title collection. Let me see, can I summon Shenron real quick? Sup, Hercule. I can't summon him just yet. Is there something I can buy in the shop, though? I'll check it out. Check it out, shop. Oh, a little shopping today. Abilities, these are characters. So you can buy Frost. Leaflo, Borgamo, I know, I know. Anna, Anna Laza, everyone's favorite, Cascuna and Rosie, Frieza Soldier, Spopovich, Super Kojita for some reason, who feels like he should probably not be here. Same thing goes with what the fuck is Ultra Instinct and Gogeta doing here with like Videl, Mecha Frieza, Kui. This makes no sense, but sure. Some outfits. Wish my husband would take me shopping a little more often. And don't we all, Bulma? Wait a minute, you're the one who makes the money in the relationship. You should not be out here oh, doing yeah. it. I've got this too. Is this? No, this is uh, Piccolo. I thought for a second it was something else. I thought this was this was Cell, but then I forget something related to Cell. You just want it all, don't you? I sure do, Bulma. I sure do. You can find this is probably in the customization things. Now that I think about it, I should have gone to the customization option just to see what was up. All right, who needs to be customized? You're not gonna tell me. <laughs> I have to just fucking guess. Uh, it's this one. Yes. Do you want your Goku mid to be shirtless? Do you want him to be actually like this look the best? I'll go with that. Can you have an emote? Left-handed greeting. I am a Saiyan who was raised on Earth. Can you give no thumbs up, unfortunately? I am a Saiyan who was raised on Earth. <laughs> Alright. Uh that's marking zero. I'll probably have some more videos coming out for randomly and because I'm enjoying the game, having fun. There's a lot put into this, a lot into the presentation, but that's enough for now. Until next time, everyone, you guys have a good day, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out. I forgot to show the best part, the custom battles. These aren't working right now, which is really sad, because I tried to do this a little bit earlier. Now I'll legitimately end it after this. Um, so there's bonus battles here, but also if you go to the world library, you can see what other people have been doing and have been cooking up. Um, so you can go, some of these people are like, yeah, the strongest warrior, you can be Jiren, and you can fight a bunch of dudes, but then you go to hell, here you go. It is, for whatever reason, Jiren, Beerus, Super Saiyan God Goku, Super Saiyan God Vegeta versus Raditz, Nappa. Daedoria, Zarbon, and uh, Deborah. 
And right now, I don't think you can actually, like... Uh... Can't do much from here. I am trash! Can you play currently I am trash? <gasps> they fixed it! I'm gonna play some I am trash. The earth shattering heated finals continue. Just how many years have passed? Both of them have been b battered blue. I get it because they're both colored blue. Go for it. Make this a match to remember. How will it end? Ribrian. <laughs> I am trash! Beautiful. We're evenly matched. We know everything the other is going to do. Where is she? There she is. Can you... This this was not made for her. Love. Oh my god. We're literally so evenly matched. It's not even funny. Nope. Come on. Hit back. Okay. Oh! Oh god. Oh, I'm getting completely trashed in this I am trash battle. Come on. Come on! Oh my god, she's completely destroying me. I am trying to do anything, and she is completely stopping me at every given point. Come on, come on. Oh my god, I'm just gonna lose this. And she just completely beat me. Don't know what was going on there, but it's clearly she's the better trash person here. I lost. She was stronger. Is that person now gonna see that I lost <laughs> to this? I hope they do. Anyway, that was I Am Trash. Uh, this wasn't working when I was doing it, but I'm glad to see that it's actually legitimately working now. Amusement Park's arrival. No idea what any of this means. But, uh, hopefully people will be able to cook up a bunch of stuff. But anyway, that's legitimately the end of it. Thank you very much everyone for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Oh, uh, where's the stop recording? There it is.